In Africa, women have a long history of bringing under control obstacles to keep their heads above the water. So, it comes as no surprise whenever African women are recognized and decorated across the continent and globe for performing brilliantly well in their various fields of endeavor. In Kenya, for instance, a list of national media sensations will not be complete if Julie Gishuri is missing on such a list. A renowned entrepreneur and media personality, Gishuri has a stake in more than three booming business sectors. In addition to being the most successful female TV presenter in Kenya, she is also one of the most influential female personalities in the East African country. To her credit, Gishuru has earned great respect as an acclaimed journalist and brand ambassador for many charity organizations in Kenya and Africa at large. Julie Gishuru was born on 7th January 1974 in Wanye Estate, Dagoretti, Nairobi. Julie's parents are of two diverse ethnic backgrounds. Her mother is a Kikuyu from Kiambu County, while her father is an Indian from Kashmir, a state in northern India. According to reports, her father entered into Kenya as a migrant in the early 1990s. He later took up a job with a railway company, which was under construction by the British government at the time. Julie attended St. Christopher School in Nairobi, from where she proceeded to the Green Herald in Bangladesh, where her father was posted for military training. She subsequently enrolled at Currency School, where she spent a term before joining Loreto Convent Msongari in Standard 4. She went on to do her Form 3 and 4 at Imani School Thika, but this was after she was pulled out from the local 844 system to the GCE boarding school. Although Julie prides herself today as a professional criminal lawyer, her childhood dream was to become an actress. She gave chase to her childhood ambition by enrolling for acting classes at the Phoenix Theatre in Nairobi, which had mega income and was at its sitting stages at the time. Because of these constraints, Julie dropped out of the acting school and decided to study law. During her university years, Julie Gishuru worked at a food factory in the UK so as to assist her father in raising her school fees. She initially worked in a food line where her main duties were to identify and remove soil products from the food chain. Gishuru is a professional criminal lawyer, having obtained an LLB and MBA from the University of Wales, Cardiff Law School and Cardiff Business School respectively. Upon her return from law school, she secured a position at the Kenya Television Network. She later moved to Capital FM before securing a reporting gig at KTN, from where she moved to NTV and then Royal Media Services. Julie's 15 years plus stint across the fields of broadcast, print and digital media have seen her pioneer impressive number of television shows in Kenya. While working at the Kenya Television Network, Julie started an investigative series called The Inside Story, a show that focused on crime, corruption, and injustices in the Kenyan society, which saw her get a job at NTV before moving to Citizen TV to host Sunday Live. At Citizen TV, Julie Gishru held the position of Group Digital Business Manager, a very big role at Citizen. Julie later made a big move in 2017 by leaving Citizen TV to join KBC. On her KBC program known as the Africa Leadership Dialogues, she has managed to interview many heads of state and prominent leaders. It's indeed safe to say she's an accomplished journalist. Julie Gishuru is the CEO of Arimas Media, a production group consisting of producers, directors and filmmakers. Julie and her husband are also the founders of Footprints Africa Foundation, created to empower and grow healthy educated societies in Africa. Footprints Africa is the mother of Great Debaters Contest, a show that provides a platform for discussions and exchange of ideas on African challenges and opportunities. Julie also heads the Natambea campaign, which empowers people with hygiene information and delivers shoes to schools in disadvantaged areas. The renowned TV personality Julie Gishuru is married to Anthony Gishuru, a practicing pilot and an entrepreneur. Tony is said to have come from one of the richest families in Kenya. The perfect love bird walked down the aisle in a lavish wedding on November 29, 2003, and their marriage produced five children. Julie would have been a mother of five, but she lost her son David Arthur Maura sometime in 2005. Her child's death did not only leave her devastated, the tragedy almost brought her to her knees and has continued to traumatize her to date. According to an interview carried out by Drum, Julie admitted that her child's death was the lowest point in her life, and she still writes poems to her late son to keep the memories fresh. Nevertheless, the super mom and her other children Daniel Gishuru, Joseph Gishuru, Kimoshe Gishuru, and Jerry Gishuru have all managed to put the tragedy behind them. Although Julie has a multitude of fans and admirers on her side, she has been careful enough to keep much of her family and private life under the wraps. This we believe could have given the rise to the various misconceptions and endless speculations about the iconic journalist. Julie also recalls how she survived on her grandfather's pension in Dagoretti upon her return to Kenya from the UK where she was studying law. This forced her to abandoned any dreams of searching for the bar and instead decided to look for a job to help her with the bills. Things got so hard that she confessed to having gone an entire day without eating, only for a family friend to turn up in the 11th hour with a basket of food. 
because the bar meant one year of not getting paid, she decided to go to a TV station to give it a try. She knew she could write, and being a lawyer, she was taught on how to be articulate. This is when she went for a screen test at KTN, where she landed her first job. From that day on, Miss Gishuru went on to become one of the most recognizable faces and voices on Kenyan TV. At one time, Julie went on to add the younger generation to embrace their difficult days, as it was part of their journey towards success, setting the trials and tribulations faced by characters in the Bible such as Moses, Joseph, and Daniel. Julie Gishuru has managed to create a name for herself and her journey to becoming a successful media personality. This can teach us that life has many different paths and that you can achieve anything you want to achieve in life. The power lies within you. Don't forget to subscribe if you are yet to. Hit a like, share with a friend or family and also drop a comment if you can.